Okay, it's another game. I'm not going 0-3. Oh 3-0 three. Three oh would be nice. No, I'm not going 0-3. Oh uh, can't tell if that's the war from earlier. Oh, double sword, double sword priest time. Definitely. I actually quite like this as an opening hand. It would be nice if I had something to play with the swordsmiths, maybe. Do I have one cost minions in there? I have North Shire Cleric. Okay, my ideal draw at this point would be North Shire Cleric. Please. Jesus, please. I know you're not real, but please. I'm going to offend someone horribly with that comment. Uh, okay. And turn. That was a really exciting turn. Oh. Yeah. Okay. In this case, I will not drop the swordsmith. I will drop the loot hoarder. And then he either swings me for one, which really does nothing, or I trade my loot hoarder out for his gold shire footman, which basically makes the loot hoarder worth the two mana. Because, yeah, I'm going to trade the loot hoarder. Yeah, it makes it really, really worth it because it gives me. Oh, I could injure Blade Master as well. That would be a really nice. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Ninja Blade Master! Medic! Trade that, so it's killed a card and it's given me another card which makes it so worth the mana. It's like so worth the mana, dude. Um, I'm weird. Time for Grizzly comes out. Not a problem, basically. I'm going to save the Swamp Ooze in case he plays like a Gore Howl or something. Gore Howl is a very good card. I'm going to heal that. Hopefully he doesn't have a cleave, although he's a warrior, so he probably does. And he's got quite a big card. And Injured Blade Master's right now 5-2. And I can just keep healing it. It'd be nice to draw North Shire Cleric. Hint, hint. Although I only have one, so maybe not. Yeah, the more I think about it, I don't think I should have taken Shadow Form. Or I think I could have afforded to take Arcanai Soul Priest. But I don't think I should have... Oh, damn it. Oh, well. He takes five damage for that, and I can just drop the ooze next turn and screw him. What can I soul priest? Um, actually, I could shadow form, ping, swing. I'd lose the swordsmith. I don't think that's worth it. I don't think that's worth it. He repeated to himself because he's crazy. Let's drop another one of these. And I'm just going to ping him and see what I get for swordsmith buffs. That's pretty nice. They're both charged up a bit now. Although, actually, that's not that great. Well, it doesn't really... Oh, son of a gun. So now he takes out my swordsmith. Yeah, he takes out my swordsmith, the full health one. I weep quietly in a corner. Armor made to fit. Yep, I made to fit your face. <sighs> well, hmm. Could mad bomber and pray to the gods of RNG. And then if that doesn't work, I don't really want to do stupid stuff for stupid reasons, though. Well, let's see. He's not that big a threat. I mean, he's 3-1. At any point, I can Shadow Form and ping. So, the best play might be to go Soul Priest. Heal that. And by heal that, I mean kill that. And he gets two armor from that, but that's not that much. He can't kill the Soul Priest next turn without cards and if he wants to use like execute or something he'll have to swing with weaponsmith I'm pretty happy with that turn so let's see what happens kind of had a bad feeling about this game because he's just gonna swing me oh balls Okay, I'm going to Mad Bomber. And Demolisher. But I'm going to Mad Bomber first. Yep. Yeah. Mad Bomber. 
Come on. Nope. Yep. Yeah, there we go. That's what Mad Bomber's supposed to do. And I think instead of healing, because healing's not actually of any use to me, I'm just going to power word shield this so he can't kill it with the Arcanite Reaper. And then I can just start firing Demolisher shots every turn. Which is a surprisingly effective strategy. Oh, nuts. That's annoying. That's very annoying, wow. It's hard to express just how irritating that is. I wonder what he's going to do. Heroic strike! Oh. Well, at least he's wasting three of his damages. Oh, man. <sighs> well, let's see. I guess Razor Fen Hunter. Razor Fen Hunter, Shadow Form, Heal. Except it's not heal anymore, but anyway. And we'll pray that the Demolisher hits any of the targets that aren't my Mad Bomber. Okay, fuck's sake! Come on! Fucking one in four. Random explosives in this game. Oh, for goodness sake. I can't believe I didn't draft a single mind control. Oh, I have like no, like zero way to deal with that sea giant. None. Shadow Word Pain's no use because, yeah. Well, I can do that. Swing, it'll be on four. Three. Well, I can just in three turns I can kill it with Mind Blast. Maybe he'll randomly decide not to attack and I can just wait until I draw in a fire. Oh my god, why do I never draft useful cards? Oh, for goodness sake! Well, I can silence the Frost Wolf. Which makes it a 4-4. Four, four. One and three, wonderful. I'm assuming he's just going to trade the Frost Wolf for it. Yep. He's probably got some, like. Okay. Well, at least he's played most of his hand even though I haven't got a hand at the moment, and I'm not likely to have one for a while. I don't know if Spiteful Smith works if you don't have a weapon. I assume it doesn't. Oh, he's a snap drawer is a terrible card. 2-7 without taunt is rubbish, basically. So, he's not even going to... Thought Steel might save me. Thought Steel is going to save me. Although, maybe not. Well, let's see. I think the best thing to do is drop the Frost Wolf for 5-5. Five, five. Ping, swing. Now we can only do 4 damage per turn. Hopefully he'll play 2 minions and I can mind control tech one of them. Stampeding Kodo is useless to him. Well, not useless, useless. Play another card. Do it. I dare you. And that's an execute. Yep. Fucking called it. This is what I don't like about Arena. Like, for some reason, I never seem to have the cards I need, and the other guy always does.
basically all I can afford to do here is Holy Nova. And Mind Control Tech. And I guess. Just do that, I guess. Oh, this is terrible. He'll probably just swing at me. <sighs> Why couldn't he have just played like a Murloc Raider or something? Well, the Twilight Drake only gets two. He does five damage this turn. Holy Nova, go. Fuck you, Alarma Bot! I'm gonna play you, and hopefully you'll die. And you'll deserve it. And do you know why you'll deserve it? Because you're fucking Alarma Bot. Fuck you, Alarma Bot. He's won next turn unless I draw Jesus, basically. Jesus? Yeah, great. Great. Mm hmm, wonderful. Well, that was awful. <sighs> Maybe the pack will redeem itself, but I have about as much luck with packs as I do with sawing my own foot off without it hurting. Let's see. Here we go. Five gold, two dust. And a pack. And no pack. Let's see. Fifteen gold. Better than expected. Twenty gold. Ten dust. That is one of the worst things I've ever had from Arena. Not even enough for another Arena run. This pack better be bloody godlike. Any rogue cards would be great. Let's see. Nope. Uh, I can't tell whether it's an epic or a rare because I'm colorblind. Uh, so... Oh, Blood Imp's a pretty good card, and a second Druid of the Claw. That's pretty nice. Okay, which one's the epic and which one's the rare? I genuinely have no idea. Uh, that one? SI7 Agent. Pretty happy about that. Apparently that's the epic. South Sea Captain! There are no words. My first epic's a Hungry Crab, and now it's a South Sea Captain. Why? What did I do to deserve this? Well, I guess it's pretty SI7 in my rogue deck. Let's see. Uh, uh, Golden Sinister Strike should probably leave. Yeah, much as I like you, Golden Sinister Strike. No. Is that a Chill and Yeti? Hmm. Don't really want to ditch Chill and Yeti. Yeah, let's ditch Sinister Strike. Well, I guess that could have gone worse. What does the South Sea Captain even disenchant into? Let's have a look. South Sea Captain? Oh, there it is. Disenchants into 100. No, what's its flavor? Its flavor text would be amazing. That's not even funny. Well, that's the end of that. I guess I might try and do some more and not suck. But until next time, bye guys.